Meanwhile, political risk analyst Dr. Theo Echampon says the Haruna Idrisu leadership of the NDC in parliament performed creditably well in keeping government on its toes. According to him, the quality of governance from the parliamentary side has improved due to their hard work. Speaking on news file, he said the reshuffle points to other factors at play not related to their performance in parliament, but in the party. I think Haruna um, Muntaka and Avedi, um, looking or from where I sit, they've actually performed creditably well, right, as the leadership of the minority in actually holding government to account. There were question marks about what this hung parliament would mean for the country, and I recall there were even conversations about uh, there might be some potential um, horse trading and, and things like that. But I think by and large, they've been able to hold the, the government to, to account and the quality of governance um, from the parliamentary side of things has actually improved with this 137, you know, split house um, each. So for them to be reshuffled um, then tells perhaps um, some of us that there are other factors or considerations at play, and not necessarily because of the, uh, um, uh, the work that they're doing in parliament and for the party.